it's not just also about that legal experience, but what we've done beyond that and outside of that. And, and that's why I, I think I'm a very strong candidate. Um, however, being not political, I'm out there on my own, you know, making my way to make myself known. Um, it's about what we do with our, our, our legal degree beyond that. Um, I, I gave you some pamphlets. I have been and I continue to be a speaker on, on various issues. Um, I, I do PBI for the Pennsylvania Bar Institute. I'm an instructor on issues of custody, family law. Um, I do those free, of you know, they're my time, but I'm asked to do them, I present to them because it's a way to educate lawyers. PBI, that's Pennsylvania Bar Institute. Um, and we give credits to lawyers. Lawyers need their continuing legal education credits, so we, we instruct. Um, I, I put a pamphlet in there from one of those. Um, I speak on behalf of the Pennsylvania Coalition Against Rape. I've done those seminars for them. I've been, I've spoke for the Pennsylvania Coalition Against Domestic Violence on those issues as their designated speaker. Um, I, I do it on behalf of the Justice Center in Scranton, but also in my own right. Every, um, the last two years I've presented to our local bar on issues of crimes of violence, of, of crimes of sexual assault in our county to raise the awareness. Um, I've trained police officers, law enforcement, state troopers. I have went in, I taught medical professionals, doctors, um, nurses on, on reporting, on when you deal with a rape victim, how important their medical reports are, what needs to be in them to be. I, and I've done this throughout my career because as I advanced and I became more of an expert in the field I did, I was then asked to go out into the community and, and I gladly accepted that because it, it seemed like something I needed to do and that we need to do to make our society safer and if I have that expertise I shared it. Um, I serve on the Luzerne County Domestic Violence Task Force. I, I was on that in the early days when we first started out and, and we're there. I'm the Lackawanna County Domestic Violence and Sexual Assault Task Force and right now I'm on the Susquehanna County Domestic Violence Task Force. The reason being because I've already served on two very successful task force. Susquehanna County just started theirs. I was asked to sit on that because I can assist in formulating these policies and moving things in a direction. I, I greatly embrace that because I've been doing this since the 90s and, and to see counties moving well, I think it's, you know, in that direction, I, I'm glad to share that experience. And I think that's part of, again, to be a judge you need to be civic and community minded and, and and be able to bring all of these things to the table.